Hey everybody, it's Peter Green from Agile for All here, coming at you with your daily dose of Agile. Today's Friday and on Friday we talk about humanizing work, which is the movement to make work a better place for humans and humans more capable of doing great work. Uh, today, we want to talk about how COVID has impacted the event. Uh, er every year for the last several years, we've had a humanizing work conference, an advanced learning event where we get together with, um, oh, about 100 of our closest friends and uh, learn more about how we can humanize our workplaces and how we can be effective as leaders in that movement. So this year, due to COVID, we've canceled that movement. It's usually a beautiful event in the early summer up in the Colorado mountains. Uh, but due to the pandemic, we have decided to cancel that for obvious reasons. Uh, and so the Humanizing Work event being canceled has caused us to ponder uh, what the movement means to our team a little bit. Uh, and the four themes of Humanizing Work, uh, those being growth, um, creativity, um, collaboration, and impact, uh, have not changed due to the cancellation of the event, of course. And it's caused us to kind of double down on how do we accomplish those things even during a pandemic, even when we're remote. Uh, so we've been pondering those things um, and thinking about how in many ways they're more important now than they were when we were together all of the time because we have to, we have to use more effort and uh, be more thoughtful about how we do things like make the impact of the work clear uh, to do things like collaborate effectively, uh, to do things like focus on growth, even when there's a lot of stress in our lives, uh, and to focus on creativity. What can we create? What outcomes can we create uh, even when there's some high stress around us? Uh, so those themes have been even more important as we have, like all of you, struggled with the pandemic. Uh, as we look at uh, the future of the movement, uh, we're still really excited about it. Uh, we'll have the event, I'm sure, spun up in 2021 again. Uh, in the meantime, there are lots of ways, of course, that you can stay connected to that movement. Uh, those of you who have attended that event in the past, uh, we encourage you to get on our Humanizing Work community Slack instance. That workspace is uh, full of lots of great people discussing lots of great things. It's it's much more of a community space than it is an Agile for All curated space. So we have lots of people messaging each other and communicating with uh, their peers through that uh, Humanizing Work Slack. If you wanna know how to get on that, if you've been to a, a previous event, let us know. We'll help you get uh, connected there. Uh, we also, for alumni, we have our first Friday sessions, which are a free uh, resource for anyone that has been to the event in the past. For those of you that have never been to the Humanizing Work event, which is probably more of the audience that might be watching this video now, uh, a few things. We'll, we'll link to uh, several resources in the text of this post as well, but wanted to point out that uh, both Trisha Broderick and myself will be speaking at the Agile Virtual Summit, which was organized uh, by Adam Weisbart, our good friend. Uh, and we'll put a link to that as well. It's a way to stay connected to us as well as some of uh, my favorite people in the broader Agile community. Um, awesome folks that are gonna be speaking at that summit. So there's a, a, a virtual offering coming and there are several of these uh, virtual conferences, uh, some free, some, some with some cost. We encourage you to seek out as a way to stay connected with the broader community during this time. Uh, so we'd love to have you uh, stay connected as a community. Um, if you enjoy the video, go ahead and like that, uh, share it with a friend. And if you want to stay connected uh, through these daily videos on weekdays, uh, go ahead and subscribe to this channel uh, and uh, on YouTube, those of you watching it there, and you'll get notified when we post the new videos. Thanks everybody, I hope you have a great weekend.